So for whatever reason, you may actually have to ban people from your YouTube channel, um, be it internet trolls, be it people that are just bothering you in some other way. Um, there is always a quick, easy way to do it. You'll normally find that a lot of channels will normally have less toler tolerance for people attacking other people within their commenting section, for example. So this is the first method. If we scroll down to our comments, you can see Tony Chadwick's here. Um, I'm not good. Tony's comments obviously perfectly fine, but to ban somebody, it's simply here. You can report hide user from the from the channel. Uh, once they're hidden, the comments won't show up. Uh, you can report spam or abuse. Uh, I don't really want to click on these. I wonder if I could do it to myself actually. Let's try and ban myself. No, I can't ban myself. But basically that's that's where you go. Normally I'll report spam or abuse first and then just hide the comments. That's the first place. Now we'll go through to our comment section. So we want to actually find our videos. So we'll click on here on our YouTube button. Then into my channel. slow come on my channel now into video manager okay stop the script yep video manager okay so now we go into community And here we have some other comments. As you can see here, there's a little flag. Report spam, hide the user, always approve because if they're a good commenter and they don't create any problems, you can actually approve them so they automatically never get um, tagged because sometimes if they put a, uh, what do you call it, a link to a website or another YouTube video, say, for example, oh, this I think you might like this video, then it might be seen a bit spammy, but if they're on what's called a whitelist, they will always approve their comments. But there you go, report spam or abuse, hide this user comments. And this is within your comment section. Uh, what you'll also find is if somebody's held for review for whatever reason, this could be it's a bit spammy, or they've been sending a lot of this similar um, messages on multiple channels. Or, well, the same here, like the spam, you, they normally get held in there for review. Now, if you go to messages, which is the, where people send you direct messages, um, here you can go here, there's one here, um, just like the uh, view. Let me drag this over. You can see, I could say spam or abuse or hide the user's comments, and that would deal with this guy. Although, He's obviously not doing any harm. He just has to be able to actually take a look at his channel. So no issues with it, but I'm not really going to subscribe for subscribe because I, his channel's not what I'm looking for. But he's not doing any harm, so I'm not going to delete or ban him simply because it, he hasn't justified it. Um, so that's three ways of going through and dealing with people. Now, say... This guy was abusive. This is the other way. If you click on his name, this will take you to his channel. Let me slide that across. It's just loading. And we go to his about. They've normally got a Google page in there. But let's go to the top. There you go. Block user. This will block him. Um, obviously you can report him as well so if it's something like a personal attack I'd recommend doing a report user then block user but I want to say I'm not blocking or anything like Cal, of, uh, Cal or Lobster um, it was just it was the first profile I come across but that's the four ways to deal with anybody that's trolling doing abusive commenting etc etc thanks for watching